4. Capacitors, Part 1. A capacitor is a component which can store charge and release it afterwards. In other words, it's just for temporary storage. A basic capacitor is made up of two parallel plates separated by an insulator in between called dielectric. The circuit symbol is like this. These two parallel lines represent two parallel plates. Some capacitors are made by rolling up metal plates with dielectric in between. So here is an example. We have two pieces of aluminium foil as two parallel plates and in between them there is this wax paper as the dielectric. What does a capacitor do? A capacitor can be charged by connecting it to a power supply. Here's power supply. Here is the capacitor. During charging, there is a temporary flow of electrons. So electrons will flow out of the negative terminal of the battery and deposit themselves on this plate. At the same time, some electrons will be taken away from this plate by the positive terminal of the battery. So the end result is this plate is negatively charged, that plate is positively charged. They are equal and opposite. As a result of these two charged plates, there's electric field in between them. When the capacitor is fully charged, the potential difference across the plates equals the supply voltage. So if the supply voltage of the battery is 6 volts, then the potential difference across the plates is also 6 volts. And the strength of the electric field between the plates is given by that formula, which is a rearranged form of this formula. And here is a simple example to illustrate. Capacitance. The capacitance of a capacitor is the amount of charge it can store when connected across a potential difference of 1 volt. The larger the capacitance, the more charge it can store per volt. And the formula for capacitance is C for capacitance equal to charge stored divided by the voltage. And the unit of capacitance is ferret, capital F, and it's a, it's a big unit. That's why the commonly used capacitances are microfarad, micro is one millionth, nano, even smaller, pico, even smaller. And here is an example, a simple example to show you. The examples here are one millifarad, one microfarad, one nanofarad, one picofarad.